hello welcome to my DIY today and today I'm going to show you how to make a cover for your mop that sounds fun huh but you'll love it because you're not going to spend a ton of money on uh, making covers for your mop and I'll show you how to do that okay and here's the mop that I'm talking about it's a Swiffer or something I can't remember I've had it so long poor be that thing and it was wonderful when it's brand new and I think I'm not gonna buy a new one because there's no sense in throwing this away when I can make my own covers. And I didn't like the covers anyway, just a thin piece of paper thing. And I'm, I'm, I'm going to show you how to do this and you don't throw it away, you wash it. That's a concept that a lot of you may not know about, but uh, I'm going to show you how to do that. Okay, come in here to my sewing machine. These are just washcloths. Okay, so I just take these washcloths and I take two of them. Let's get to a different color so you can see what I'm doing. I'm just going to take two of them and overlap them just a bit. Sew these together and then I'm going to sew elastic around and then you slip that right over your mop. Okay, let's get to work. And just to make sure your mop will fit, fit I just put that over there. And then when, when I sew that elastic around it, it's going to curl right around there and get all tucked in nicely. So I can see there's plenty of space, so let's overlap those just a little bit more. That's what's going to be absorbing all that, all that work. I mean, all that dirt on your floor. Okay, that's how far I will overlap it. Alrighty, let's get to work here. So all I'm going to do is just sew these like this. You can feel it underneath, so you don't need to know. All right, you have that. Now, it's just going to sew some elastic around it. Okay, I've got some elastic, and I'm not going to measure it. I'm just going to sew it on. All right, let's get this sewn on there. I pull that really tight. It kind of gathers underneath. put that on our mop head. See it gives you a nice little wrap to put around your mop. We've got double washcloths here. Okay, let's go do that. Okay, here's our mop and hold that to put that around. Just slips right on there. You've got a nice cover for your mop head. Now let's get to work and mop the floor. Just get it wet and get down here on the floor and that stays on there and you can mop your floor. Now wherever it is you do your floor, okay? Go all the way around the house and when you're done, slip it off and tuck it right into the laundry. Okay, now this is my old one. Notice it's got a big hole in it. <laughs> So, I'm just going to take a washcloth. I folded it in fourths. We're going to repair this one. Still good. I usually just put this underneath, but I'm going to actually sew it to it. And then I'll st uh, still have one. And then, also, with the washcloth, I had an ice pack, but little Oliver bit into it. You know, those little blue things. I need to put my ice in. I'm just going to sew this up and this up and put my ice in there. We'll show you how to do that. Okay, so here it is all patched up. No more hole. So I just sewed that washcloth into there. See? Now that'll mop up a floor nice. And that's the old one. And then here's the other new ones. There's that one. This one washcloth. And here's the other one. Okay, now with the ice pack, I got my 
bag of ice and the washcloth. See, that's going to fit right in there. So I'm just going to sew up the side and then put the ice in there. Okay, that was easy. Just sewed it up and left a, a little pocket here at the top. Slide the ice in there. Got it in a Ziploc bag. There you go. Now I have an ice bag. Okay, now I have my, my mop covers. One, there's the old one. One, two, three, four, and the one I just put in the wash. And my ice pack. And then just break the ice up a little. There you go. And the reason you're going to need an ice pack is because you've been mopping the floor all day with your new covers. <laughs> Thanks, and I hope you like that DIY on my mop head. And yeah, sure, you could go buy more, but why? When you could just uh, just use it in the washing machine, just toss it in there. Fix it up, wear it out, make it do or do without. Just make things work for you. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And good night, everybody. And uh, make sure you subscribe right here. Hit the subscribe button.